Hello guys, Zuljin here and welcome to The Great Adventure. So I was looking around at some different mod packs and I decided to play something adventure isk I guess you could say. I'll scroll through the mods while I'm talking about my psychology behind it. So I started looking at the, the old maps like the old mod packs like Tale of Kingdoms and um, stuff like Simucraft and I decided that they were a little bit too old so I started looking around and the Technic launcher had this neat pack called the Great Adventure and as you can see I'm scrolling through the mods to give you guys an idea y'all could pause the video at any time if I'm moving too fast but it should give y'all an idea of what kind of mods are in here and I want to do like a nomads base series like I really don't want to build a base and do all kind of branch mining and all this I kind of want to just stay moving and try to take on some objectives and I figured we'll give it around 10 episodes unless you guys really really love it We'll say at the end of 10 episodes, if I've amassed 2,000 likes over the entirety of the series, we'll keep it going. So let's go ahead and make a new world, and we're going to call it Zul'jin's Great Adventure. Zul'jin's... oops. If I can type right, I don't even know what key I hit to make it go back all the way. Great Adventure. And I hope that it doesn't spawn us into something like a bad area. Let's see, more world options. No, we don't need all that. Everything is standard. We'll go ahead and say create new world and we're gonna put it in hard mode as soon as we get in as well. I think this is gonna be a lot of fun. Um, a bunch of the things that I love about adventuring in Minecraft um, come to life in mod packs, but there's all kind of other fluff to distract me sometimes. For instance, like this mod has Archimedes ships, but there's no other way to fly. So it might it might do good to actually Wow. Excuse me, I'm talking. What the <laughs> That must be Mo Creatures. So the like the what I was saying about Archimedes ships is that it might be it might be useful, you know, to build one because that's like the only means a flight or whatever. Oh my gosh. Sound needs to go down. Wow. Okay. So here we are. It looks like we're in... I don't even know what kind of biome this is. This is a... I don't even see what the name of this is. Um, a, a taiga. Okay. <laughs> I, I should have known, but at any rate, I need to get a little bit of wood set aside. So... We can just start by moving, guys. It looks like I'm in a weird place, like all snow and ice. Let's grab a few logs here, and we'll just get some basic tools online. So yeah, I've really been wanting to supplement. Ever since I stopped Mod Sauce, I've kind of wanted to play mods, but I've, I've been wanting adventure-based stuff. Like, don't don't get me wrong. You know, I like mod packs, um, but the kitchen sink mod packs don't have quite enough direction to them and I've really just wanted something a little bit unique lately you know what I mean something to get my blood flowing and I think I was talking with a friend the other day about mod packs and and um, and trying to get some ideas on what to do so here I am trying this out anyway this should be pretty fun let's go ahead and just get a pick going here and then we'll just dig down a little bit and we'll go from there uh, let's see. I'm gonna take this with me because you never know. Sometimes I end up in a cave and I want to keep going and and all sorts of, of stuff. So all I really need is a little bit of stone. Just like um, probably about less than 20. We need enough for one of each stone tool and we need a little bit for um, like a furnace and stuff. So here we go. Let's see. One, two, three. There's our pick. One, two, there's our sword, there's our shovel, there is our axe, I don't know why I said just the there, <laughs> and we need enough for a furnace. One, two, three, four, five, and then when we have our enough for a furnace, we can pretty much go and maybe kill a couple of animals, get some food, and start roaming. Because like I said, I really don't want to have the branch vine or anything like that in this series. I just like to kind of just have fun. And let's place our crafting table right back down. Um, let's see. We should be able to do an axe right quick. There we go. Bam. Axe. Already in the making. We'll do a sword like that. <laughs> I don't know why that didn't want to come out. Now we got a shovel and we'll also need the pick, which we don't quite have enough wood for. There we go. 
we'll do a pick all right so tools in hand we are ready to go let's just do a furnace and then we will be good to go all right so the cool thing about this mod pack too is it has tree capitator in it uh let's find a good tall one we'll just use that one <laughs> and this will give us enough wood for a good little while just by chopping down one tree and it'll work like that pretty much anytime we need it but it'll be a great way to kind of start off our coal supply without having to go underground and and cave and stuff not that i'm opposed to caving i just don't want to take uh, the most conventional routes right away you know what i mean and there's ducks and birds that could be pretty cool for feathers let's see yep a little bit of feathers is that a dove Woohoo! <laughs> um, I, I know this is like a sign of peace. That oh, it's just bird. You just sound like a dove. Well, apparently. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay, feathers. <laughs> it's funny Minecraft. Like vanilla Minecraft doesn't have birds. That would just be so cool. Not that. I mean, I already know our animals just make too much noises. Look at this guy. <laughs> we definitely want that hat from you. Hats. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> cool. Look at me. I'm already ready to go. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Oh, there's some string right there. What is a what is a spider web doing in a cave, though? I mean, I know what it's doing. Did we already find an abandoned mine shaft? That would be pretty cool. But I do need string for... Oh, there's ice. Okay. Let's get... All we need is a couple more string for a bow. That would be really nice. Oh, look. It's kind of like... It's on top of it. That's really neat. I think it's going to get dark really, really fast right here. What is that? Iron ore berry bushes. Holy cow. Can I mine these up? Awesome. I forgot about ore berries and stuff. That's another thing that you usually don't pay attention to in these big super mod packs because there's always better ways to do things. I see some coal right there. Let's go ahead and grab that. And then it looks like that is the end of our little caving adventure, which, we, like I said before, I want to do the unconventional methods of most of this anyway. So, but it would be nice to find a couple more cobwebs. That was neat. And what is that? An ice shroom? Oh, apparently I didn't have the right tool to break it. Okay, so I've got a little bit of coal, so we won't really need to worry about using our wood for charcoal. Uh, we'll have enough to cook the meat that we just got and... We only have three leather, but I don't really know what leather would be good for. I guess armor. Then again, there's probably a ton of different armor we can craft. I just tried out the mod pack earlier just to make sure that everything worked correctly. And uh, it did. So I know there was some helmets and stuff. I was looking to see ship's helm from Archimedes Ships is what I was looking up. But I see all sorts of different, um, different helms here. So some pretty cool looking stuff. Hide helmets. Maybe we can get some hide. Reptile helmet. Paladin helmet? Candy helmet? That's kind of weird. Okay. Well, we'll definitely check that out in just a few minutes. What was that? Now, I have to be real careful. Like, I don't want to die. I know, I mean, nobody ever wants to die, but I really don't want to die. Like, I want to preserve my life. You know what I mean? I want to, I want to, oh, another thing I got to do is go to options and, yep, difficulty is hard. Good deal. I wanted to make sure it's hard. Look at that, y'all. What is that? Is that a battle tower? Oh man, that looks really, really, really cool. Okay, I'd like to. Oh, there's spawners all in it. Okay, the, isn't that great? No. Okay, so I'll need. I definitely need sheep for wool, so we can make a bed. There is a couple of wool. I need one more. It looks like I'll have to go get that guy. Let's see. I need your wool to make a bed because when it turns night, when it turns night, I need to be able to sleep through it. Okay. And incidentally, we are up top to where we can get a better view on this thing. Okay, so it looks like we could probably cheat this stuff. Oh, those are cave spiders? Or do they just look like cave spiders? We are not equipped to be able to do this right now like we aren't at all you guys there is like we we're gonna need some armor you saw the spawners and stuff we definitely gonna need some what is that what <gasps> oh no 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 wait 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 
What in the world just happened? He was glowing and stuff. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Hold on here. We we definitely have... Houston, we have a problem. That was way too hardcore. <laughs> like, I didn't even get in the door and that sucker almost killed me. Okay, we got some coal. I'll tell you what. Let's, let's cook us a little raw beef. And we got the zombies after us. We really need we really need to eat so we can heal up and I don't know if I want to take that on. I really don't. But that was crazy like he was glowing. Uh, I don't know. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. But all right guys, we're just about <laughs> Every time I start talking, those birds start chirping. Maybe that's why we didn't add them to Minecraft is because they're extremely loud and obnoxious. Okay, so I still don't think I'm going to take this Dorn thing on, but I would like to just, I really would like to check out that um, that chest right quick. It's just too tempting, so we'll try out the first floor. If I know these things, if, if I remember correctly, basically you have to climb them until you get to the top, and then a big boss spawns, and I'm not nearly ready for that. But who's to say that I'm not ready for a little bit of that chest action? Um, I don't know how fast I can get there. I'm just gonna try it. Oh, gosh. Okay, that's why. That's that's not a good idea. No, 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 no. What the heck? Stop! <laughs> Target! Okay, good news is that we have a death point, so we can just roll back to it. Bad news is that I don't have a bed, and it's going to be turning night. So, so much for that not dying thing. There are already mobs spawning. This is not good, you guys. Um, there is going to be a cave spot. Oh my gosh. Look! Look at the stuff after me already! Oh man, and we gotta break the gravestone in order to get into it? This is not good. This is not good at all. Okay, guys, we're gonna have to get in a hole somewhere and bury ourselves because these guys are not gonna leave us alone like at all if I can even get in without kill it without getting myself killed oh man okay well the good news is I didn't have anything all right I'm just gonna wait until the morning and go back oh what is that there's another tower over there shoot um all right I got two death points now I'll tell you what I'm just gonna wait until the morning you guys we'll be right back all right, you guys, it is approaching day, so I believe I should make my way. And I'm starting to see, like, werewolves, I believe, which are very, very frightening. But if I make my way around here, I should be able to get there with with as little as harm possible. I just have to be real careful not to fall in any of these caves. Um, there was my other death point. Oh, wow. Um, I don't, I don't want to fight you, dude. Ouch! Good lord! This thing's hit like trucks. And he set me on fire? Oh man, I'm toast again. Sheesh. Okay. Well, clearly, the name of the game is just run and gun. That's what I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to go for that, that very last death point and grab the stuff that I originally had. Oh, man. I gotta lead this guy away from my stuff, I guess. Yep. Yep, come on, follow me over here. What? Oh, man. So he just stopped attacking me? But there are other things around. Ah, oh, there's a skeleton right there. Okay. So he couldn't follow me there. Please. Oh, I got all my stuff back. Oh, maybe... Th no, that was my wrong death point. Okay. The one over there is the right death point. Okay. I cannot believe I didn't die right there. He doesn't have a bow? How'd that happen? <laughs> well, I like it. He gave me arrows too, poor guy. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, there's my stuff. Okay. Oh, will you hush? 
eat this food right away so we can heal. What is that? Is that a deer making that noise? Oh no, that's, what is that? A mole. <laughs> okay, Mr. Bull. All right, I see iron. That's definitely a good sign. I only see one though. That is probably not. Ah, I see a couple over here. All right, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make my way over to this side and try to grab this iron. I think that is gonna help us out immensely. Let's get our tool situation back in line as well. Um, also, we really need to put together a bed so that never, ever, 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 ever happens again. <laughs> okay, axe, dirt. Okay, now I've got everything that I need to move forward. Let's try that again. Good, some gravel. I don't think I need gravel for anything, but the flint is nice. If we can kill a couple of those ducks that I saw earlier, I'll be able to use that for um, for, for arrows. Um, if we ever kill spiders and stuff. All right. That looks good. There's a couple of iron there. I shouldn't do that. I have to be more careful. Okay, so I got four iron now. I don't know oh, what I could do with that. Oh, I got... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where did that come from? A cobweb just came out of nowhere. That was not there before, was it? What was shooting at me? Huh. Yo, that was so weird. Okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna move forward here. It's almost as though something pillared already. Look, it's like a little bridge right here. I don't know. That's kind of wild. Okay. Well, one thing's for sure: we are not messing with that tower. Not yet. We have to be much, much, much closer to ready than that. Uh, speaking of feathers. Oh, that didn't actually give me any feathers. Okay, I'm gonna grab some of these pigs. To get some delicious pork meat. I don't know what those groundhogs give me or those moles give me, but... Okay. I'm not gonna mess with it right there. Oh, there's another... Th man, there's these those towers everywhere. Okay, what I wanna do... Like, I feel like I need to go on this suicide mission. For some strange reason, there's a pumpkin over there. I don't think I need that for anything. Um, oh, and there's something right there, too. What is this? Ah, uh, it's a roguelike. All right. So, plenty of stuff to get in those roguelike dungeons. The first level of them we should be able to take if we have some torches at the ready. I thought, oh, we, did, we do have a little bit of torches. Let's get a few more. And what I'll do is, I need to throw some of this junk away. All right, so let's do this. Actually, let's take away the waypoints that I have already. Remove all of them. And we're going to set a bed down right here. Isn't that a smart plan? Bed. Or is that a bed? Sometimes there's a bed already in there. Let's, let's go up top and look. I'm just going to go up right here. Um, oh, wait. I, I figured there was something in our way. Okay, there's a chest right... <gasps> Salvation. Salvation. Okay, this is base of operations, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, <laughs> this is our new base of operations. Okay, so let's do a... What, what were we going to do here? Let's put the furnace down here as well. We got the furnace. And now we can put in this, and we can start cooking up this iron. That should be enough for an iron sword, which will be cool. Um, wow, look at all this stuff. So we've got protection one, unbreaking one. And this is unbreaking two, blast protection two. And this is protection two, unbreaking one. This is definitely the better ones. Okay, so we're going to put these on right away. All right, now we got pants, baby. Uh, a little bit of food, some bones, some string, some more torches, bone. Oh, more stuff in general. I like it. Um, more torches, bread. That's the memo by Greymark. I've seen that in other mod packs. I'm familiar with it. I'm just interested in the loot. Okay, 
So now that we got all that, we could probably put some of this junk up. Iron ore berries, I don't know if I'm going to be harvesting those right away. Um, they just give nuggets, so it doesn't seem, unless we set up a farm for that, it won't be too good. So I got a stick right here. I can actually do, we can actually do a bow. And that is going to, that's going to work out well. Um, hold on. Bow is going to be like this, actually. And then we've got a few string. Perfect. All right. Well, now we're dangerous, y'all. We are seriously dangerous. Got a couple flint. That'll give us some extra arrows. Perfect, man. All right. Well, I'm feeling really, really good about this. Let's see. We got four iron ready to go now. We should probably just go down and see what we can do. I've got a little bit of defense now. So I'm kind of feeling brave. Actually, you know what? Making an iron sword seems like it would be much, much better than what I currently have. So... Let's do, actually, let's do sticks first. There we go. And, well, even though, man, I should really do an iron pick in case I see some rare ores down there. But, you know what? I'm going to do the smarter thing. I am going to do that. I'm going to make an iron pick instead. It's just the smarter way to go, you guys. And I'm going to use good old faithful stone sword for the time being. All right, let us proceed down into the dungeon, shall we? Um, we're not gonna go too deep. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just gonna try to get some quick loot and get out of here. Uh, let's see, I have a little bit, I hear a skeleton already, which is always bad news, but um, okay, so all of those areas are sealed off, which is good. What is that, may I ask? Um. I don't like the way that looks. I really don't like the way that looks. Okay. I don't see any chests right off the hand. But I like this way the best so far. So let's go ahead and break through here. Also need to put blocks on my hot bar. And food on my hot bar. Okay. Gotta be real careful here. What? What? <laughs> oh gosh! What is that? A flame wraith? Oh! Yeah, fight each other. Is that that wraith making all that racket? What in the world? Okay. Oh, oh. Chest. What I got? Tequila? <laughs> I just wanted some... Oh, man, no. I, I torched you. Hold on. Regroup. Regroup. Ouch. Come on, die, sucker. Man, these roguelikes are horrid, y'all. They really are. Okay. Well, I'll put a torch on it, too. It's just, it's not enough. I get, what was that? Was that iron back there? No, I think that's, is that, oh, that's copper. I don't need copper for anything. Um, okay, that's enough. <laughs> that is enough. Okay, let's try, let's try down this pathway. What is that over there? Oh, that's a werewolf. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna kill you. <laughs> okay. Wow. Hold up. Okay, these guys have to get in melee range to hurt me, so... Speaking of, I really need to eat. And there appears to be... Oh, that's better than nothing. Okay, I'm gonna run in and torch. Run in... Torch. Boom. Ooh, a tempered blade. That's what I'm talking about. Put this iron away. I don't need it no more. Instant horming potion. Sounds good. What is that? There's a chest over there. I really want to see what that is. Uh-oh. No, maybe I don't. Run away. Run away. There's a werewolf. Run away. There's a werewolf. 
Oh my gosh. There's another werewolf. Go, 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 go. I don't have blocks on my hot bore anymore. Is they following me? Did I just say, is they following me? <laughs> oh, yep, they are. Okay. I know this is going to hurt, but... Okay. I had to make it to where they couldn't come in. I just got to take this guy down. Almost. <laughs> what an adventure. Look at these guys. That's a werewolf. Okay. Well, I got a couple neat pieces of armor, at least. That is really, really good. All right. Well, I feel really accomplished now. Okay. Let's heal up and make one more run. And we're gonna we're gonna try one more run here. I'm gonna be really careful too with these uh with these blocks and stuff. Okay, we gotta run in and light that up. Run away! <laughs> run! Alright, come here, you suckers. Come here. Oh, gosh. Quick. Woo. 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 Okay. Now I got to heal. Look, look at my body. Oh, my gosh. They wrecked my face. Strength 4. Mining fatigue 2. Wow. That's something. Tequila. I like the sound of that. Okay. So let me heal up a little bit first. I did light that torch. That's good. I see a chest right there, too. I can get that. Okay. Weakness, slowness, mining fatigue, laudanum. This is for pain. <laughs> Crazy. Stone sword. Okay. So that was a weak chest. But I'm going to grab this bread since I have it. Actually, let me offload some of this trash that I have, too. Um, I don't know why I have all of this. But... I think I don't need snow for anything, I don't believe. Okay. We should be pretty good. I see a creeper over there. Is that a chest? No. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll... Oh! Like, I have a light on the spawner. Son of a gun. Okay. I think, you know what? Idea. Oh, what in the world? What is that all about? Hold on. I saw something, and I'm curious... Boots, I'm putting you on. Protection 1. Blast Protection 1, that is definitely better. And Projectile Protection 1. Let me close this off. Man, this is intense. Okay. And what is that? That is some kind of skeleton warrior. Okay, I'll tell you what. That's it. <laughs> That's it. I am out. I am finished with this place. It is way too dangerous. I thought roguelikes were dangerous uh, on mod sauce. This is just bananas. Oh, perfect. And it's dark. Uh, did I put the bed down up upstairs? I did not. Let me make a bed. And I'll sleep in it. And save my spawn point. Even though I don't think I'm going to be spending any time here. <laughs> I think I need to move on and find some better armor and stuff. But that was really, really good. So I got a few things. That's awesome. Um, and in fact, I think I'll just put some of this stuff away. I think that's the sound that a werewolf makes when it dies. Or it goes back to man form. I don't know, but... At any rate, oh, there's a skeleton there. I have to be careful. Some of these things. Oh, what? What? What in the world? A rare deceiving silver skeleton bomber. 50? Okay, guys, I have to kill this thing. I have to. What the heck? That must have been like an infernal mob or something. And I have a status effect, but I got something. I got a um, a magic axe. Efficiency 2 iron axe. <laughs> That's, that rocks. You can get rare m mob drops? 
I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yep. Here, there's the werewolf that probably uh, probably turned. Yeah, he's at 15. No, I'm definitely killing you. You guys are evil. Okay. Oh, is that a house? Wait. Spruce a boar? Ouch. Okay. <laughs> is that a helmet have a chicken? <laughs> he has a hat on. That's funny. All right. Let's get a few of these beef. And some leather if we need. And let's check out, what is this house? Is this a witch hut? That's what it looks like. Any loot? You got any loot in here? You got apples. Yeah, this is probably a witch's hut. Okay, well, we don't need anything in there. Let us continue on. That is really, really fun, though. Like, that was, that was some kind of adventure, but we need to just keep on moving. What is that? An ant. Yep. That's what it is. That must be a, a birch ant. I don't want to have any trouble with you. There's an oak one. No trouble with you. That looks like... What in the world? Oh, that's one of those towers. And a portion of it is like... Destroyed. Oh, and there's a chest right there. Y'all, these are the most... <laughs> unbelievably tempting things... Like, you see chests and you just want to get them. I'm going in to try to get it. I'm going to do it. Oh, that's a, it's a spider room. It's spiders. And there's the skeletons and there's... Hold on. I'm going around this way. Watch this. Hold on. Stuff is dying. What if I just break through this? <laughs> There's the... There is the, uh... The freaking... Oh, it looks like I can't reach it. Or is there something under it? I mean, on top of it, preventing me from... Ah, I got it. Coal? Yeah, I didn't need that. That was trash. Okay, well, well, that's news to me. Um, guys, we need to we need to try this out. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to mess with this a little bit. <laughs> I'm not gonna go all the way. <laughs> Apples <laughs> and more feathers. Okay, let's do let's do one more level. Uh-oh. Okay, mushrooms and yeah. <laughs> I'm not I'm not doing this. I'm not going up cuz I know there's bosses to fight at the top and I'm not I can't do that. And you can't sneak the top one. I know you can't. But man, if we we could get some like Archimedes ships going to raid those towers, I think that would be really really cool. <laughs> Let me get out of there. Wow, well, that was a whole lot of fun, and I think I'm definitely going to continue playing this, you guys. I hope you all really enjoyed the episode. Next time we come back, we'll uh, we'll try to get into some more trouble. So thanks so much for watching, you guys. As always, this is Ulgen signing off, and we'll see you next time. Bye!